Good, Good morning, Saints. Saints. I'm Isaac. And I'm Jace. Today is Wednesday, February 22nd, 2023. Happy birthday today to Braden Breyer, Aiden Cahill, Eli Cardi, Carter, William Haynes, Riley Robertson, Cooper Welsh, and Maslin Wilson. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, fish and chips. Mmm, mmm, mmm. In sports today and this week, the Gina Russo Showdown happened, and here are your winners. For the girls, the Scrubstitutes. For the boys, Bobby Yu. Way to go, guys. This Thursday, there will be a mandatory meeting for anyone who is planning on playing for the men's lacrosse team this spring. The meeting will be in room 120 and will start at 315. Today, Saints bowling team will be going to regionals during school. Good luck, guys. Get a turkey. Friday, Saints basketball will take on Blue Valley West here at Aquinas. Girls at 530 and boys at 7. Track and field season starts on Monday. The team will meet at 3.30 in the fitness center. Signups are on the team website, or you can use the QR code on the posters in the halls. The center of the day today is the chairs of St. Peter. Every cathedral has a cathedra, a bishop's chair that is used only by the bishop when he presides in the cathedral. It's a symbol of his authority as chief teacher and liturgist of the diocese. So today, we celebrate the authority of the Chief Bishop, St. Peter, and his successors, the Popes. Here's Mr. Blaze's video with an announcement on the new morning prayer. Howdy, Halo. Mr. Blaze here to give you the scoop on our next morning prayer, the Anima Christi. This prayer dates back to the 14th century and was a favorite of St. Ignatius of Loyola. Anima Christi translates to Soul of Christ. And the simplest way to think of this prayer is, wash me clean and make me full. The Anima Christi is a great reflection during adoration or after we receive the Eucharist. Please consider adding this to your routine at Mass. Now for some faculty perspective. Miss Price enjoys the powerful nature of this prayer and is drawn to reflect on each word and the deeper meaning within each line. This prayer is not just one that you say, but instead that you sit with. She points out that to sanctify means to set apart. We are in this world, but not of this world. Mr. Brown has been saying this prayer after receiving communion since he was in school. His favorite teacher urged everyone to start praying the Anima Christi after re returning to their seats from communion. Mr. Brown is drawn to different lines of this pr prayer depending on what is going on with his life in his life, particularly the line, within your wounds conceal me, speaks to him. Thanks. Lent is here, and that means prayer, fasting, and almsgiving is about to hit us in full swing. Campus Ministry is issuing a challenge to the whole SCA community to dive into this season of Lent. Join the 111 challenge. What exactly does this challenge involve? It involves giving up one thing, picking up one thing, and focusing on one sin. Fill out the challenge card in SCA today and bring it to Mass. Place it in the basket as you enter the gym. Make this Lent a powerful season to prepare to meet Jesus at Easter. In recognition of Black History Month, NFL player Jerry Rice scored an amazing 208 touchdowns in his 20-season career. His closest competitor is Emmett Smith with 175. We have a very special guest coming to SCA on February 24th. He's a former KU football player and current KU assistant athletic director, Chris Hughes. The Diversity Club is pleased to invite all of you to the main gym during STA to hear him speak. Come hear, his, come hear this incredible leader tell you how to use pride in healthy ways to improve your life and activities. Today is the last day you may purchase your data match results from last week's Valentine's Day promotion. Go to the Spirit Shop to purchase the results for only $2. No data matches will be available after today. Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We will be back with more for you tomorrow. I'm Jace. And I'm Isaac. Signing, Signing off. off. Remember, stay classy, saints, and embrace the moment. moment.